Office Online is not formerly known as web apps. What it basically is is a lightened up web-based version of Word, Excel, PowerPoint, or OneNote that you can create and edit straight out of your OneDrive account. So I'm signing into my Office 365 OneDrive account. To create a new document, I can click the New button and use any of these tools. Or I could click the waffle in the upper left-hand corner and use the Word Online, Excel, PowerPoint, or OneNote Online tool to create that document. So I'm going to create an online Word document. I know that I'm using Word Online because one, I'm still on a web page, and two, it says Word Online in the upper left-hand corner. You'll notice there's no save button. It saves automatically, so that takes some getting used to. To rename your document, you click where it says document and type your new name. And then if you're working and you decide you really want to open it in full word because there's a feature you want or you're more comfortable that way, look for the link that says open in and then whatever application you're in. Click to launch that application and it will go ahead and open it in the full version that you can continue working. Now from the online version to get back, you need to click on your name or you could use the back buttons. Notice that any new document has this little green signal symbol by it. To edit it, you click the name of the document, and right now, I feel like I should be able to edit, but I actually have to click Edit Document and then choose whether I want to edit in the full Word document or the full Word application or in Word Online. So I choose one of those and I can start editing. I'm going to go back into my OneDrive window. Remember to get back to other parts of my Office 365 account, I click on the waffle, I can go into my Outlook, I can go into OneDrive, or I can create a new document. So that is Office Online.